Hey there, welcome back to Keepies Collectibles. We are on another Goodwill adventure today. And I started with the artwork and these next two pieces I thought were so fun to look at. They had so much detail and you could literally look at them for hours. And then I came across this one picture that I thought would work very well in my new home office on my gallery wall that I'm collecting artwork for. Now, check this beauty out. She is a snow woman and she's from Department 56. She is from the Snow Pinions line and she's perfectly priced. Look at her face, perfect carrot nose, no chips. And of course, I had to point out, she tagged the girls. Look at her eyes, look at her face, adorable. Now I believe this was some type of lantern. I found it interesting and it was $9.99. Now I thought this was perhaps a little tea light. I wasn't sure what it was. I thought it was quite beautiful. Now I'm drawn to mugs lately and I noticed the Starbucks coffee mug. I liked that it was just a plain black color and there were no chips on it, no cracks on it and it was a really nice looking mug. And we saw this beautiful teapot for one. It had this adorable little cactus on the front and on the back. It was $3.99 made by Mikasa. Don't tell anyone, but I took the tape off and was able to look underneath the lid to see if it had cracks or chips. And it was in perfect condition. And it is a cutie. Now this piece is the farmhouse decor. It looked as if someone had this in their home perhaps. And they did a really great job. And the price for this was 99 cents. And honestly, buying this just for the flowers to reuse them in something else was worth it. Now, as I looked down, I came upon this box and it looked as if it had the Hen Spongeware Pottery. There were only three pieces and I started to pull them out, and you can notice there's a mark on the bottom, and uh, my husband graciously decided to let me put the camera down and take a few pictures so you could see what was in the box. Now, I do love this pottery. I have to admit, every time I see it out, I'm always going to pick it up and look at it. $3.99. Not bad. And you know what? You could put a few succulents in that and it would be absolutely beautiful. Next, we have another mug, but this is quite an unusual mug. It's called a mustache mug. And would you drink your coffee out of this mug? I mean, many people would, and some people just collect these types of mugs. But he has a very interesting face. Look at the nose and the, and the teeth and that mole. I saw this vase and I thought it was really lovely. I turned it over and noticed it was Hager 
and it's not an old piece obviously it has the sticker with the, the UPC code but it was in super good condition and I really liked the way it looked it was a lovely vase and then I came across this piece I'm not even sure what to call this I don't know what this is there are two masks and I don't know if it's a school project or what was going on but I'll just leave it at that if you have any idea what this could be let me know down in the comments and these little plates were darling I think they were supposed to come with teacups and I didn't see teacups around there were no markings on the back but they were so sweet and beautiful and $5.99 The first thing that I purchased that I would like to share with you is this Starbucks coffee mug. Now this mug was in wonderful condition. It was black and my husband uses a lot of mugs so I thought I would pick that up for him. And if he doesn't like it, I'll eat cereal out of it. When I saw this piece of pottery in Goodwill, I knew I had to have it. I really love the shape of this piece. I use these same colors in my home and I plan on using this piece that I picked up for $3.99 to plant succulents. Next, I of course picked up the cutest little snow woman. She is a Department 56 piece and she's from the Snow Pinions and I just love everything about her. And she was $1.94 and I will be keeping her. I found this hen spongeware pottery in a box on the bottom shelf at Goodwill. It was for $15.99 and it's this really pretty pitcher and two mugs and it is in really beautiful shape and I plan on placing those in my booth. Next I found this amazing wooden box that I'm going to use in my home office. I really love the look of it. I love that it's super sturdy and I'm gonna put a little polish on it and shine it up and it's gonna come in handy when school starts. I picked up this Hager vase and I like the shape of it. I like the color. It has a little farmhouse vibe to me. I think it's because of the color, but I will be selling this in my booth as well. And finally, I could not pass this beautiful picture up. Now it took me forever just to clean the frame and glass. Now I notice there's a little spot on the picture, but I'm thinking about having this reframed, rematted, and giving it a whole new look. And I'm gonna use this in my gallery wall in my new home office. All right, that is it my friends. Thanks for joining me today. Go ahead and like this video. And if you enjoy this type of content, subscribe to my channel. It's free. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye.